my name's uh, Andrew Vasalo. Uh, my farm at a place called Brightly, which is about 35 k's west of Mackay. Been on this property since 1992. I'm a second um, generation cane farmer. You know, I thought I was doing everything correctly, but um, with, with the 161 program, we've just um, refined the, my fertilising program a um, hell of a lot, and um, and just just have the you know, have the peace of mind in the back of your mind that you're, you're doing I'm doing everything correctly to the best of our knowledge of the information that we've got at the moment. So I come and saw Andrew and talked about what 161 could offer him. And Andrew's quite an investigative type of grower, so he's always looking for opportunities to either confirm or to challenge what he's doing. This program, it's, it's, it's more um, yeah, soil type related and um, it, it just brings it down from a, from a larger scale down to a, a more refined, refined area. So we just pulled everything together and filled in the gaps that were existing in where he could confidently apply the rate as per the regulations. Before we um, before I signed up, John came out and explained the whole program. Um, we went through it all. Before the fertilising program, I provided my soil tests. John calibrated all that information, put it all together. Made it quite simple. You know, I haven't got just little blocks here and there all over the place. It's quite quite easy. You know, it's quite uniform. It's all soil, soil type related. You know, I've got the, the, the map on my phone, so you know exactly know um, what to what to put on on where. Very simple. And um, if there's any questions, you know, John was always on the phone, and always too too happy to try and help me out. We didn't make massive changes to the top end and the bottom end, but what we did do is give Andrew a lot of confidence to what he would do and where he was doing it, and we just demonstrated the process of how we came up with these numbers. We addressed the nitrogen levels in different blocks. Um, we think we've got them down to, you know, industry standard, I think. So um, I'm involved in a water sampling program also, so it'd be good to see if we get any, any, any runoff as well. So, yeah, so, you know, with all that information on hand, we should be able to come up with some type of formula to, to prevent, you know, come up, come up with a, a good number, I suppose, yeah. So as part of the, the 161, there's also biomass sampling, which analyzes the nutrients that are in the cane. And this allows a more thorough investigation for what the cane has extracted from the soil in relation to the nutrients that we've put in. So that can provide um, another source of guidance as to whether your application rates are being utilized. Yeah, I'll support, you know, um, encourage all growers to, to get on board really. With this program, all your recommendations are all done an easy format to understand and the beauty about it it's all your record keeping on your fertilizer stuff is all done is all done for you as well all you got to do is really apply a put a, an applied date to it and pretty much I, th I believe that's all your fertilizer you know record keeping and application all done and so simple just one headache that you don't have to worry about. It.